thank you for joining us and if you're here for the first time welcome we are happy to have you here today we're going to be doing uh, eat with me exotic fruit so we have a lot of fruit here interesting fruit some of which you can find in the can form but today we decided to eat it fresh so let's see how well we can enjoy Jeez, they're this. fresh we're going to try these and we're going to peel them and then this is dragon fruit and we're going to try this as well and of course this this big spiny thing here is jackfruit so yeah you can get jackfruit uh, a whole fruit it comes actually weighs up to anywhere from 20 to 40 pounds it looks like durian except for the spines are less pronounced than the durian um, but you can get this canned and it's very delicious so we'll see today if it tastes better fresh of course you know old-fashioned bananas nothing special there so, who wants to get started? Let's try the dragon fruit. So, what does it look like? It's got these little spiny type. I don't know, what would you say, honey? What? Describe it. Well, no, it's just covered with, uh, in almost sense, it's like uh, petals. And it's yeah, it's got these overlapping. interesting right. overlapping petals. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it in the middle. Ooh, look at that. So do, do we eat the skin? I don't know. I, don't know. <laughs> I just, you know, it's usually in beverages and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't think you I eat the skin. I actually haven't had fresh dragon fruit. Or no, or you don't eat the skin as far as right, I'm no. aware. Yeah. So I've got a really sharp knife. I'm just going to go ahead and peel it. It's a little kind of tough to peel yeah. it maybe at first. Yeah. Yeah, it's got this dense fleshy skin. Actually, look, it does peel off easily. Mm. I love the color. And yes, my hands are clean. So I'm just gonna go ahead and slice it. And the kids are here with us. So they're gonna have some too. All right, honey, go ahead and try it. small one yeah. it's kind of it tastes like uh, like nothing I've ever tasted before. <laughs> no it just tastes it's just um it's a, right know, like me and Mariam and I have had this before but, it, uh, it, it doesn't have a guava. very strong taste to wow. it it's kind of crisp it's got yeah. black seeds it almost I don't know it tastes like just a, a, a less sweet guava. really doesn't oh, have much of a taste. Maybe a, a kiwi has a more yeah, it's prominent not a sweet, taste. Right. It's more of a texture, right? Because you get the texture of the little seeds that are in there, and um, it almost could taste like a vegetable more so than a fruit. It's not really right. sweet. It's not that sweet. It's not sweet. Okay. Yeah, I just know more of it as. Juicy. I think they use it a lot for decoration or I've seen them put it in drinks to make things look very exotic and pretty but to be right. honest it doesn't have much of a taste right. huh. okay and he's gonna try it he'll be our next guinea pig did you just smell it <laughs> in some cultures it's okay to smell food but in other cultures it's actually considered rude what do you think? Right? It doesn't have much of a flavor or taste to it. It's more of a texture. <laughs> He's so strange. What do you think? It's like... It's like what? Flavorless kiwi. It's like flavorless kiwi? Yeah. yeah, I guess. It's the closest thing you can imagine. So is that a yes or a no? No. Nah? Nah? We'll no pass? Alright, All right. well now we know. Alright, so it has a little bit of a tougher outer layer. You just peel it, and then there's a soft flesh underneath. So just like a grape. So you, except just the outside is just a little tougher. So you just peel it, it reveals this, this white, almost translucent Ooh, it's flesh. very juicy. Right. 
Now these I know are really good because they come in the can. And then there should be a dark seed in the middle of it. Right. Is that pretty? Oh. And there's a seed. Watch out for it. <laughs> They're quite sweet. Fleshy. <laughs> so, what are we watching tonight? Game of Thrones. Your favorite character in Game of Thrones? Sure. Mariam, your game favorite character? Daenerys. Daenerys? Kareem? Yeah. Your favorite yeah, character in Game of Thrones? Oh, Who? Bron. Who's that? Not Bran. Bron. Who's Bron. that? Oh. He hasn't been oh, yeah. in a while. So how could he be your favorite character if he's not even on the show? He is on the he show. Is on the show. show. Just Which one is he? I don't remember him. He was Seltor. He's Seltor for Tyrion. Huh. Okay. Oh, the, oh, that. His friend. It was kind of like his friend, the fighter, the bodyguard guy. Yeah. Right. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. I don't watch it. So. Khalid, you don't watch it. Beyond. No, <laughs> That's the guy with no genitalia, the guy who got emasculated. That's why it's a joke. That's why it's a joke. Oh God, I hate that character. Why? why? I don't know. I just can't stand him. You feel bad for him? Feel feel bad feel bad for him? He was evil. Not I mean, really. he didn't he's deserve all of that, no, but he was evil. He's not I don't evil. think he's evil. He's, he's making bad choices. Cut it. Yeah. Um, First, I think you got to take eat away this. the yeah. core. Yeah, this, this, yeah, you don't well, eat this I mean, part. You don't eat this skin, so and then no, these are the pods that you eat, and these are the it? seeds yeah. that you don't eat. Know, right? Yeah, that's why it was so expensive. It was pretty expensive. You're buying it by the pound, but you're not sure how many pods you're gonna get. And they say it's sweeter, the brighter yellowy, yellowy orange. Here, the first thing I'm gonna do is cut the middle. I, just, I know it's going to end up going through. Yep. You'll see, you'll see. Have faith. Okay. Look. Beautiful. You might have to cut the seeds a little bit, but that's okay. Um, then you cut the middle portion off. Let's see, it's a little bit. You want to avoid cutting the pods. Try not to cut myself either. Actually, it comes out. Yeah. So this part you don't eat. This fleshy, stringy part you don't eat. But it should come out nice and shiny. And you take out the seeds. There's a seed in there. And it has the same texture as the stuff you get in the can. So that's what it looks like. Yeah. All right, Kalek, you get the first dip. It's sweet, isn't it? It's actually really sweet. It tastes like candy. Yeah. <laughs> it really tastes like candy, doesn't it? All right, I'm going for another one. Looks kind of savage of me sitting here trying to grab it, but it is what it is. It's different. Right? It, it's, I mean, I think it still is intense as what you get in the can, but it just tastes a lot fresher, obviously. And it really tastes like candy. What are you doing? Does it taste like candy? <laughs> What kind of candy? What kind of candy? What? You can also use these to make a shake. We make a really good jackfruit shake. Um, just add a little bit of condensed milk or regular milk. Okay, let's put a few here. Yeah, so like Mariam, I'm making this for you. So actually, so it's not just here, it's actually through the middle. So as you pull it out, so, it's, so you have flesh. And it's firm, 
so it's not like you know it's it's like the as firm as a nectarine so it's not as soft as a peach so it actually will hold when you pull it out yeah <laughs> go ahead college would you like to try pulling it out yeah Pulled out. Yeah, sure. First impression. Um, I don't know. It tastes like mango, kind of. Just not as sweet. Um, but it is sweet, isn't it? Kinda. It's like um, you know, the Asian store, the um, gummies, like the the grape jellies, gummies <laughs> that would be like in a circle. It kind of tastes like that. If you were stranded on an island, you could live off of this, you know? Yeah, it's just it like eating coconuts. If you had no other choice, you could survive. You would have to survive on just this. You'd like coconut better, Kareem? Yeah? Oh yeah, there's a lot of pods in there. So it looks like it was finished, but... Um, actually a ton we're lucky today it's really nice and cool well not really cool but it's a lot cooler than it's been during the week because uh, as you know this country has been going through some major heat wave especially here in North Carolina so we're gonna play a game let's see how much you guys know about your parents right all right where did your parents meet college Kareem the cup College where? If Cornell, Ithaca, does that count? New York. Why well, well, said Ithaca was in New York? I want a specific place. I where did we Cornell. meet? Cornell. Okay. In your dorm room. In my dorm room? No, her friend's <laughs> dorm room. It wasn't her <laughs> dorm room. So okay. That's not right. That's pretty good. I think I get Khalid, how old was your mom when she met your dad? <laughs> 19 like yeah. Yay! Bing, 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 bing. Yeah, so he said the right answer. I thought you were like 22 or something. 19, you I was. Your first year of college? I was actually going, I was in my second year you of college. Well, I was 19, oh, 18, so she must have been smart, huh? First year, it would have been 19, she's in her no, second year. No, first year is 18. I'm 18. But you finish, she's 19. Well, she's I don't know what right. to tell you, Marian, but I was 19 when I met your father. Vietnam, yeah. <laughs> We're in Vietnam. Mm. She told me. Told I remember. She um, took a picture. Um, no, I saw it. Saigon. That's no, wrong. Not Saigon. It was, um, it started with a B or a G, something like that. Go. It was two words. What? Aren't I right? No, it's not. You were right. It's, I was well, right. it's, it's, a little, it's a little, it's a little, it's a little, it's a little it suburb outside of Saigon. But See, it, it wasn't, it wasn't it was Saigon, still, though. Saigon is the right answer, right. right. Mariam, what branch of the military, <laughs> what branch of the military was your dad know. in? I don't know. The army. Of course. What do you mean you don't know? Army click three, Miriam zero, Kareem one. I have one. I have one. I got the first question. Kareem, <laughs> your dad was in the army at one point. What branch of the army was he in? Branch. Yes, branch. branch. What? He doesn't share that stuff. If I didn't know it, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I'm just She's so infantry. rude. Infantry. Bing, 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 bing. Infantry. Oh, yeah. oh I forgot. Oh, That's the way. levels. You're Whatever. Oh, I You're bad. My bad. This is so bad. bad, Daddy. You are not talking to your child. No, I thought. They I don't know. pay attention. I, did, I told Except you that. Except I don't remember. It's been a while, see? Yeah. But where was your dad's dad, your grandfather, who you've never met, may he rest in peace, where was your dad's dad from? One of those white, like Arizona, Nevada, something like oh that. Oh my God, Miriam. <laughs> no, he wasn't. He wasn't from California. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God. It's Nevada, right? It is. It's one of those. No. Like, no. Minnesota? Nebraska. And Miriam. Oh, I heard an M. <laughs> he was from Nebraska. <laughs> Miriam, you are not looking good right now. <laughs> Four, Miriam, zero, queen, two. 
Okay. okay. Mariam, what hospital were you born? <laughs> I don't know the name. <laughs> downtown Manhattan Downtown Hospital, right? NYU Downtown Hospital. Downtown is that the correct Manhattan, name, right? Yeah, it's in Manhattan. Yeah, yeah but it's downtown. called. It's not now it's a. All right, Kareem, where was your mom born? England. Where specifically in England? I don't know. London. London. <laughs> That's your answer. It's always like, you didn't tell me. Right. <laughs> right. Like, you didn't tell me. <laughs> what? Asking, you telling me. No. We're like, yeah, you tell us stories about yourself. Yeah. You're like, oh, I don't have any, nothing you want to hear. So, there you go. All right, Khalid, where did your mom go to medical school? <laughs> South Carolina. What's the name of the medical school? <laughs> medical <laughs> University. USC. Very good. Medical University of South Carolina. <laughs> you had no idea. I didn't know that. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> well, let's see. Okay, Mariam, how much do I weigh? Nah, don't answer that. <laughs> Okay, um, where does my father, my African dad, live? Where does he live? Africa. Abuja, Nigeria. <laughs> Yoruba. <laughs> my dad? He's not oh, Yoruba. I've heard. I don't He's know. Hausa. Um, He's Hausa. Where does he live? Abuja, right? Abuja. Nigeria. That's good. He lives in Abuja, which is the capital of Nigeria. <laughs> He's Hausa, and he's Probably from Sokoto right? State. Oh, He's you good? You're listening. What? I always think you're not listening. Okay, what? Um, who's the president of Nigeria? It's above my pay grade. It's above your pay grade. I think it's President Buhari. Is that not right, Ken? I have no idea. What if you don't you're know? wrong? <laughs> what if I'm wrong? I don't think I'm wrong. If you're Nigerian, comment below. Am I wrong? Your grandmother, Nana. Where was she born? That's the longest pause. She doesn't know the answer. Jamaica. Kingston, Jamaica. Exactly. Kingston, Jamaica. I was you weren't going to get it. About you weren't going to get it. I was stuck. You weren't going to get it. So we decided to switch, uh, switch seats. And now... Daddy Kenton is going to be asking the kids some questions. Okay. While I continue to eat my jackfruit. All right. What's your mother's favorite color? Yellow. This isn't a speed round. <laughs> <laughs> What's your mother's favorite food? All food. <laughs> All food? <laughs> yeah, I guess maybe most food. Okay. Peanut stew. Peanut stew. Peanut stew curry stores. chicken. Um, jerk chicken, mm, scabich fish, mm, what else? Jumbo Oxtail. Rice. Jumbo rice? Jambalaya? Jambalaya? No, I'm not really, I'm not. I'm Oxtail. Not really yeah. Oxtail. Uh, what else? Aki and saltfish. Aki and saltfish. We're giving us all, all these Caribbean food. No, those are all Caribbean. Right. Here's another question. Now, this is a dangerous question, so just letting you guys know. What's your mother's pet peeves? <laughs> what? <laughs> you guys say he's like Brady <laughs> might get popped. He's just like sitting there. He's like, Khalid is a pet peeve. <laughs> well, Khalid knows how to get under my skin sometimes, but he's a good kid nonetheless. He's just a smart ass sometimes. <laughs> Dirty dishes, Miriam said. What else? Pass. <laughs> pass. Pass what? Gas? Pass what? <laughs> Oh, pass the question. Oh, okay. Hiccups. Hiccups. Well, thank you for watching, and we hope you enjoy the video. Yes, thank you for watching, Kenton and Habiba, and I hope you enjoyed spending some time eating with us. Um, definitely, the next time you are in the Asian market or ethnic store, go out and try something new. Can't wait to show you some more videos, so don't forget to subscribe below, comment, like, all that good stuff. Find me on my other social media sites. Uh, I have a blog, and you can also find me on Instagram. The links will be in the description box. So, yes, thank you for hanging out with me and my family. It's been real. Yep. Take care now. Bye-bye. <laughs>